Hi. Welcome to PH Red TV. In this video we're sharing a short overview about the cities in the Bicol region. As of this date, the Philippines has a total of 146 cities all over the country. A city is one of the units of local government in the Philippines. All Philippine cities are chartered cities, whose existence as corporate and administrative entities is governed by their own specific municipal charters, which specifies their administrative structure and powers. Cities are classified according to average annual income of the city, based on the previous four calendar years. The Local Government Code of 1991 or Republic Act No. 7160 classifies all cities into one of three legal categories. Highly urbanized cities, independent component cities and component cities. A highly urbanized city is a higher classification of a Philippine city, with higher qualifications relevant to population, area, and revenue. Under this classification, the cities are governed independently from its province, where it is strategically or geographically located. ICC or independent component cities, however, are the type of cities have charters that explicitly prohibit their residents from voting for provincial officials. ICCs are also governed independently from the province it is geographically located. Lastly, component cities are cities which do not meet qualifications for HUC and ICC. In the Bicol area, there are seven cities located across the region. A region comprises of six provinces, has seven cities spread across the area. And that's our topic for today here at PH Red TV. But before we continue, please subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell icon to keep you updated on my future uploads. Without much farther ado, let's begin with our topic. The Bicol region or the Region 5 is composed of seven cities, in which one of them is an independent component city or ICC, and six are of a component city classification. Here are our seven cities in the vast lands of Bicol region. Number 7, City of Iriga. Iriga City is a fourth-class component city in the province of Camarines Sur. It is located about 400 kilometers southeast of Manila and about 33 kilometers south of Naga City, Camarines Sur. Iriga City has developed tremendously making it not only a center of trade and commerce, as it is strategically located in between the cities of Naga and Legazpi. In 2019 annual financial report, the city recorded a total assets of 1.08 billion pesos and a revenue of 642 million pesos. Nestled at the foot of Mount Ariga, it's located at the heart of Bicol Economic Corridor and one of the fastest growing cities in the region. Number 6, Masbati City. As the only city in the province, Masbati City serves as the province's main commercial center and chief seaport. The city is more or less situated at the center of the island province. It is noted for its well-protected seaport, with Tikau Island acting as barrier against the effects of inclement weather. Being located at the central part of the Philippine archipelago, the city serves as the region's gateway to the Visayas and Mindanao. In the latest financial report the city recorded a total assets of 1.41 billion pesos and a revenue of 640 million pesos for the calendar year of 2019. Number 5, Tobacco City. Tobacco City is a fourth-class component city in the province of Albay. Tobacco is one of eight towns and cities that share jurisdiction on the volcano, dividing the peak like slices of a pie when viewed from above. Its economy is still heavily dependent on agriculture, 
poultry and livestock raising as well as aquaculture and fishing, are very much alive. In the latest annual financial report, the city has a total assets of 2.18 billion pesos and a revenue of 681 million pesos. Tobacco today is rapidly growing with a thriving commercial center and port area. The city has the sole international seaport in the region, contributing to the city's vibrant economy. Number 4. Sorsigan City. Sorsigan City is a third-class component city and capital of the province of Sorsigan. Sorsigan City is one of the region's leading cities in urbanization and the most promising city in terms of development. As the capital town of the province of Sorsigan is a hub of trade and commerce. Despite being a city and its increasing annual income, agriculture and fisheries sector is still the driving force of its economy. In the latest report the city have a record of 2.36 billion pesos of total assets and a revenue of 925 million pesos. Business is concentrated in the downtown area near the public market, and major commercial establishments primarily geared towards retail and wholesale. Number 3. Ligao City. Ligao City is a fourth-class component city in the province of Albay, whose economy is anchored on agriculture. Majority of its population depends on farming and its related industries. Majority of the population are tenants, and only a small portion are landlords or owners. In the 2019 annual financial report, the city had a total assets of 2.81 billion pesos and a revenue of 732 million pesos in the latest COA report. Major industries include piggery, poultry, livestock production, manufacturing, feed mill, rice mill, concrete products, food processing and cocoa-based products. Coconut is the most extensively planted perennial crop in the city, followed by rice and corn, and copper is the prime commodity. Number 2. Legazpi City. Legazpi City is a first-income class city in the province of Albay. It is a major economic hub in the Bicol region. Economic activities in the city include agriculture, wholesale, and retail trade. The city is also home to a number of retail establishments, banking and finance, tourism and education, making it as the center of commerce in the Bicol region. In 2019 data, the city has recorded with 2.91 billion pesos in total assets and a revenue of 1.38 billion pesos, Truly Legazpi is a competitive city. Number 1. Naga City. Naga City is a second income class, independent component city in the Philippines. Naga is the Bicol region's trade, business, religious, cultural, industrial, commercial, medical, educational, and financial center. The city is cited as one of the most business-friendly cities in Asia. In the 2019 annual financial report, the city had a total assets of 5.6 billion pesos and a revenue of 1.39 billion pesos, making it the richest LGU in the Bicol region. Those are our seven cities in Region 5 or Beagle Region. That's all for today, I hope you learned something new in today's topic. Thank you for stay tuning in, see you again soon here at PHRED TV.